marketing companies, they are under pressure today. Sonal joins in with what brokerages are saying. Sonal. Uh, well, CLSA has a note where they uh, continue with their sell rating on the stock. They are talking about how a cut in retail prices of diesel or petrol looks, looks less likely now. But there is a possibility that crude oil prices, they could see an uptick of around 5 to 7 percent. And this will uh, uh, cause worries over marketing margins going forward. Uh, uh, they say that government might look at raising fuel taxes after elections for fiscal consolidation. And that is another worry in terms of the output price price for consumers as well. That is about the marketing side but let's talk about the refining side as well because we've been pointing out how there's a lot of supply coming in in the refining sector globally and that is something that could put some pressure on refining margins for these companies as well. And CLSA says that five and a half times FY25 EV to EBITDA, prices of all these three stocks, they are figuring in or factoring in GRMs anywhere between nine to twelve dollars per barrel which is higher than seven and a half dollars per barrel which is the current GRM. Interestingly, uh, CLSA had downgraded these three stocks to sell on January 4th. They are reiterating that sell now. But since then, HP sale is up 35%, BP sale is up 45%, and IOC is up 43%. So yes, they are under pressure today, but we've seen a, a sharper rally, despite a lot of these brokerages being very cautious on these three stocks. Okay, thank you very much uh, for that. Uh, yesterday it was Spark, and now it's CLSA. Get into a break. On the other side, we'll discuss market technicals. Vishal Malkan will join in on the other side. Stay tuned.